December 21st, card opening. Happy winter solstice. We have our Tony Centaloon out of uh, five there and O'Neill Cruise Refractor. So this was our top chrome light box. It is going against its big brother. We're gonna see which one is better. We are gonna have the OG um, Top Hobby. Really good cards out. The out of fives are hard to predict price value because number one, they're not that many. And number two, it really depends on the collector, especially when it comes to some of the, like him. I got these Hobby boxes directly from Cantix. Um, they did send me the silver packs, which I will sit for later day. But we'll go ahead and get started and see if the Hobby Box can do any better. We get two autos, but we get as much color as crackers. Oh, we also didn't pull any Aaron Judges or uh, Paul Goldschmidt's in the last one. We start off pretty slow. I was quite pleased with the light box. Pete Alonzo, Ian Happ, Refractor, Drew Detmers. Get my uh, variations, inserts, and rookie pile going. So far, nothing close. Bowman Draft was released on top of this morning. No light boxes. They have the hobby for four hundred and fifty dollars from the Tops web page, which is ridiculous. There's a wonder free go eighty seven hundred Jackson. Wander being the best card we pulled so far. I don't think we pulled a wander in the light box. Joe Pustro, Marquez, Buster Posey. Garcia, pretty slow. Zach Granke, Kyle Seeger, Sammy Long, Refractor Rookie, Austin Riley. Yelich, not the MVP we're looking for, John Lester, Randy Rosarina. Extractor. So our number with two numbered cards. We get more cards out of the hobby box. So we could get at least two numbered. You would think. Oh, the gold. Alex Verdugo, Kevin Gossman, Lance Lynn. Ryan Mount Castle Gold. Wave out of 50. 49 out of 50. Mount Castle is well liked by Baltimore. Who played some pretty decent baseball. Not a rookie though. But we'll put him in front of O'Neill Cruz for now. So one numbered. Out of 50. Take these down and put the good ones as they come out. That sounds like a better idea. So we'll start with the Ryan Mount Castle in the center. Bryce Harper, Ron Eerfriendry, we have a Whit Merrifield, Pink, out of $3.99, Chris Sale. Garrett Cole. Just zoom out a little bit so you can see. So two numbered cards. So we match the numbers in the uh, light. We're not halfway through yet. Ernie Clement, Heart of the City, Tim Anderson, Joey Votto, Ozzy Albies. Still haven't found our two autos. I 
Amanda Tatis, Cole Calhoun. We have a Bryson Stott Blue Wave. On card auto. Blue Wave out of 150 with some dried marker on the back because he brushed it. Now, as far as autos go and rookie autos, this one's not bad at all. Normally, you're going to get who's that pitcher and how many innings under 10 did he pitch. So, we'll take a Bryson stop rookie auto any day. Soto, Jacob DeGrom Refractor, and Drew Ellis. After this, we'll be at the halfway point. They are not, are not, are not Goldschmidt and Judge have dodged us. Joe Adele, Max Muncy, Carlos Santana, and Jesus Lasorda. So, no Judge, no Goldie. Keep going. Josh Donaldson, Ketel Marte, Heart of the City, Josh Hader. That's depressing. Mike Mustak. Hader. Is he still at the Padres? I can't remember if he moved on. I'm going to get confused. No, I don't think I am. There's been a lot of movements. Trey Turner. There's Josh Hader again. This is just a haterific uh, box opening. Trey Turner on the Phillies. He'll be playing Bryson Stott. So Neil Cruz on the back. Bo Bichette. Brandon Marsh. Uh, third Jesse Winker, I think. Jesse Rangers. John Gray, the Gray Wolf on the Rangers. Scherzer, Curtis Terry. And John Gray. 8 and 12 for his last Rockies appearance. He did a lot of pitch running when I watched the game. I didn't need a pitch runner. He put John Gray on the, the bases, which I found kind of funny. Rodolfo Castro, Trevor Story, Anthony Rendon, Jake Cronenworth. Continue to elude Blake Snell, Willie Castro, Albert Pujols Prism, Zach Short. It's amazing. I know I pulled them from my earlier openings, but I got rid of all those before I moved. So, what were you going to do? Randomly hold on to people? You know, Jackson Kawar, Tell Glass, and others. Good. Give me a break. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well, I still have them up here because I don't know what else to do with them. But, in case, Christian Yelich does not seem to be one of the rarer cards. Verling, Yohan Makata, Alex Bregman, Kyle Moore. Another, come on, another hater? Luis Robert, Jake Cronenworth, Shohei. Man. Matt 
Chapman, J.D. Martinez, Tarek Skrubal, Alfio Devers. So we have a non-rookie pitcher out of Granted, a uh, decent one. That's ironic. Anyway, I'd have to say, purely on the Bryson stock being numbered, that we won that trade. we got two more packs left. I'm sure there's another Christian Yelich waiting to come forth. Your Wells, Kyle Moore, Anthony Rizzo. One more. Has a judge. And Goldschmidt eluded us. Nelson Cruz, they have, I'm pretty sure. Let me double check. Check my inserts. Nelson Cruz, Bregman, Pujols, Rendon, Hader, Santana, Jacob Begrom, Randy Rosina, Ian Happ. Nothing there. On the base. Nothing there either. I don't know what to tell you. It's two boxes, and we have not pulled a judge or a Goldie. No, it looks like I'll hold still. Hold true. So, which which had the better cards? Which had the better cards is the question here. I mean, I'd probably put these four up. And the Whitmerry Field out of three ninety nine. Ryan Mount Castle out of fifty. Rice and stop blue wave auto out of 150. And the Tech Screwball second year auto. Those are the four best ones, and I think the four best ones from the other one would be Max Krennic out of a 99, Eduardo Cabrera, Prison Ricky, Hentel out of five, and O'Neill Cruz Refractor. Which one would you take, people? I mean, minus the Bryson stop, there's not much here. So I think I would probably lean with the light box, what we got. If you took out the Bix cards, the five out of five, the Bryson stop, I'd still lead with the light. I'd take these three over those. Anyway, that's my opinion. You let us know. We'll see ya.